CodeScene's license model is based on a concept of active authors. So what is an active author? Basically, an active author is one of the current contributors to your code base. And we calculate that using a rolling window of three months. Let me try to explain. If we look in GitHub on this particular project, we can see that there have been 782 contributors. So that's a lot of people. But not all of them are active. Some of them are people that used to contribute in the past and are no longer part of the organization. So in CodeScene, we get a very different view. Let me show you. Here we have a list of all authors together with the time of the last contribution. So let me sort by that. Let's sort in descending order like this. And we see that right now we are in September, so that with a sliding window of three months, we're back to August, July, and June. In Code Scene, we will consider the following people being active authors. One, two, three, four, five, six. So out of the 700 people, only six of them are active contributors. In this case, the number of active authors would be six, and that would be what the license is based on. Finally, if you're interested in license details, it's worth pointing out that the number of users is not restricted. So even if you have just six active authors, and that's what your subscription is based on, you can have as many users as possible. So people like product, management, testers, people that don't write code themselves, they can still access all this data that's not restricted in any way.